What is going on everybody? Welcome back to another video. I am Nintendo, and guess what? I am not sick today. <laughs> this last week, I was just like throwing up. It was nasty. It was disgusting. I really wanted to get a video out to you guys. I'm trying to like do, you know, a video a week, uh, maybe a little over a week if like, you know, life happens. Uh, but regardless, today, we've got a video for you. So it's a little more topical. Topical? Topical. It's a little more of a topical video. Um, not not like review or anything like that kind of thing um, But I just want to like do my you know predictions for the upcoming Nintendo Direct that we know is coming. It's got to be coming right uh, last year in 2019 They did a Nintendo Direct um, in mid-February. I think it was February 14th if I'm correct um, I did my research did I did I? Uh, let me look this up uh, No, I did not uh, I did not look that up <laughs> um, so yeah, so we were expecting a February Direct. Um, we got a Pokemon Direct last month. Um, I covered all that stuff. Super excited for everything that was in it. Um, some people ha really hated it. Some people really loved it. I was more on the kind of loved it side. But yeah, that was Pokemon. And Pokemon's awesome. They were just giving us a little more of that Pokemon IV. They're like, here you go. Here's some more Pokemon High for you. Just going to drip that into the bloodstream there. Um, and they just they're, they want to keep Pokemon alive, and I get it. I get it because uh, Pokemon's awesome. It's sold like a ton of copies. Um, surely it's almost at the two billion worldwide. Uh, well, I think that's just for one of the games, actually. I'm not too sure. I know the numbers are astronomical, and yeah, so totally makes sense. Um, so yeah, that, that's Pokemon, and so with that comes what Nintendo wants to get onto the table, and that is Animal Crossing. For the Switch, coming at ya March 20th, 2020. You know it. I'm just getting right into my predictions now because honestly, is this re really even a prediction? We know that Nintendo is going to spend a ton of time on Animal Crossing New Horizons. That's the name, right? Yeah, New Horizons. Um, they're going to be spending a ton of time on that. And not to mention, they're also going to be showing off that awesome Switch. Hopefully they do because, man, that thing is so cool looking. Ah, oh, man, Gabby and I, you know, we've been talking about uh, getting a new Switch, and you know, this is probably, it, initially the, the conversation was a Nintendo Switch Lite, but now I think we're just going to have to get another Switch. It is the version 2 Switch, by the way. It's the one with the longer battery life, um, better hardware, you know, etc., cetera, etc., cetera. Um, but yeah, it's an actual Switch. You can dock it, and you can actually sw do the Switch can switch from handheld to the TV unlike the switch light it's very misleading it's not really a switch it's just um, it's an it's a not switch that that's what they should have called it they should have called the Nintendo switch light the not switch light because it still doesn't have all the features anyways uh, I still think the switch light by the way is is a good console for the price um, I want to put that on the record. Anyways, getting back to the video, getting off topic. Um, yeah, that new Switch for uh, Animal Crossing New Horizons. That themed Switch, the new Joy-Cons looks awesome. Ah, I'm just so excited. Super excited for that. Definitely, definitely really interested in buying that. Um, gotta convince Gabby first. Uh, Gabby, if you're watching this, uh, we might need to get it. Also, I think there's Pro Controllers coming out too. Two new Pro Controllers. Man! You know, my birthday's on March 19th, and March 20th is when this all comes out, so I'm going to be spending a ton of money, a ton of that birthday money on this. You got new Switch, $300. You got, uh, I'm going to have to buy two copies of the game because the actual uh, New Horizons doesn't come out, uh, or the Horizon New Horizons Switch game doesn't actually come on the console for US, which is kind of lame. Uh, but even if it did, honestly, you'd probably have to spend. You'd probably have to spend the sixty extra dollars because historically that's what Nintendo has always done. So it probably would be like three hundred sixty bucks. But anyways, um, so I have to spend three hundred sixty just for that. Then I'm gonna spend another sixty for my own game because um, you know Gabby wants to play it. Uh, Animal Crossing is like her favorite Nintendo series. Uh, don't quote me on that, but I think it's her. I'm, I think I'm gonna. I think I'm pretty close to that. Um, yeah, and then I'm also gonna have to buy those two pro controllers because those are really cool. I mean, can you blame me? Look at these things, they're awesome. Uh, yeah, so yeah, 
Okay, uh, as far as the obvious stuff goes, I have my list here. I've got my production notes. Um, yeah, that's all, that's all the obvious stuff. So, you know, um, what more can I say? <laughs> that's, that's pretty much gonna be the bulk of the direct, I would guess. You know, they've always done curveballs with the, especially this last thing, the most recent thing with the Pokemon Direct, we thought it was gonna be some boring stuff, but it actually ended up being some pretty cool bombshell announcements. So, who knows, who knows? I'm just gonna say, you know, Animal Crossing's coming out next month. I can't believe it, it's February. It's going to be next month we will have Animal Crossing a little over, um, actually a little more over a month because I mean, it's not February 20th yet, but it's next month actually is March. So technically it is next month. I'm super excited for this game, guys. I don't know if you can tell. Um, spent a ton of time on New Leaf in, on the 3DS. So yeah, it's gonna be a fun time. Gabby and I are gonna be having a great time on that. Probably a huge review on that because that game's gonna be, there's gonna be so much to talk about. Now, next up on the production list, the notes. Um, I'm a sing, I'm a one man band on these production notes, man. Um, so you're gonna have to bear with me here. This is the hopeful stuff, could happen stuff, but mostly hopeful stuff. That's what I titled it, anyways. Um, yeah, so Breath of the Wild 2. Now, the last thing that we know about Breath of the Wild 2 is the exact first thing that we learned about it uh back in that direct last year where it was or no 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 it was uh it was e3 right it was e3 yeah it was um at the e3 conference last year and they showed off that uh little footage uh kind of like a trailer footage or well of course it was a trailer but i mean um it was it wasn't gameplay or anything like that it was like you know trailer footage and um that's all we got and then at the very end it said it is in development so no year was given to that uh that title however um i'm really hopeful to at least get uh some more footage on that and then maybe a release date uh at least a window or something maybe they say um i don't think it's going to be 2020 i mean i really that would be super cool if this was like a uh, Nintendo's holiday title. Because, by the way, folks, we don't know what Nintendo's big holiday title is going to be for 2020. We just don't know. Um, we're expecting to get that in this direct to get us hyped for it. Um, but yeah, like we, we just don't know. There's nothing that we, we know nothing besides Animal Crossing and then a couple like like sprinkled in. Here you go. Here's some. Here's some nice games for you that are they're pretty good, but they're not like first party game. We're just gonna sprinkle these in here. We know nothing else. Animal Crossing is the, the big one that we know about, and that's it. That's really it. There's a bunch of stuff that uh, we know exists and it's in development, but we just don't know when it's coming. And that's what that's pretty much uh, what the hopeful stuff could happen stuff, but mostly hopeful stuff list is. So there's Breath of the Wild too. Um, hopefully it comes. Hopefully we get more, hopefully it comes in this direct, hopefully we get some sort of new footage or something new, some new information, that'd be great. Uh, the next one is Bayonetta 3, and I don't know if it's been like over, it's actually been more than two years now since we've learned about <laughs> Bayonetta 3, that it is coming, but uh, we haven't heard anything, literally nothing on Bayonetta 3 since that announcement. So, yeah, yeah, we really want to see some new stuff on Bayonetta 3, hopefully uh, a release date, because by now, surely, it's it's uh, should be close to being done, I would imagine, um, hopefully. Um, and then, there's a couple rumors, um, I don't like talking about rumors that much, but, you know, eh, they do come from credible sources, don't want to name the sources, because, yeah... I just don't want to name them because, you know, you know, when people do stuff like <laughs> quote unquote leak material, they're not really like, unless it's coming from an inside source, it's really just somebody who heard it from somebody else. It's never really, it, for the most part, it's never really from um, like an inside source. They usually like, I don't know, I, I really don't know how they get across this information, but um, it's not... <sighs> I don't know. Anyways, I'm going on a t off on a tangent, going off on a little bit of a, 
a rant, if you will. But uh, yeah, I mean, they do come from credible sources, and by credible, I mean they've gotten things right in the past. Leave it at that. Research it at your own will, etc. Okay, going off on that tangent, back to the main the main crux. Um, so there's two things. Um, a Paper Mario remake. Now, I don't know, I don't remember if this was the original Paper Mario that they said, or it was the second one, but it was one of the first two, and they were saying that they were going to remake that, and, you know, bring Paper Mario, kind of like bring Paper Mario back to its roots, and they were going to start with a remake to kind of get people to be like, oh, so this is what Paper Mario was like, and that you know, is a good strategy, because, uh, I'm not a huge Paper Mario fan, but I know most, uh, people that are Paper Mario fans, uh, they don't like the most recent ones, they're, they say they're poo-poo garbage poops, and, um, yeah, so they were like, you know, uh, we should probably go back to our old roots, because that's what everybody likes, and that's a smart move, good job, Nintendo, listen to the fans, always a good thing, so, yeah, Paper Mario remake, that might happen. Might just be, and it might honestly just be a port. Or, no, can it even be a port? Because, I mean, it did look okay, right? I don't know. Who knows? Paper Mario, maybe something on Paper Mario. And then the other thing was, um, like, a Metroid Prime remake, or, like, a Metroid uh, Prime, Metroid Prime trilogy on, um, the Switch. Like, a, I don't know if you would package it into, like, a remaster or, man, I don't even, I don't even know how they do that. Maybe they would just do one of them. Who knows? But we do know that Metroid Prime 4 has been delayed, and we still know nothing since that announcement of it being delayed because they moved it to a different production company. <sighs> Sad times. But, uh, to supplement that, uh, this would make sense. So, like, a, a remake of one of the first Prime games, ideally, like, the first one, then just work your way through it, or just give us, like, you know, um... The whole, the whole kit and caboodle, the whole triple, the whole triple trilogy, you know what I'm saying? Um, triple trilogy, would that make it six or nine? Triple, triple, triple the trilogy, that'd be nine. Yeah, wait, yeah, yeah, yeah. Anyways, uh, yeah, getting off topic yet again. And that is all the hopefully stuff could happen, hopeful stuff, uh, list that I had here. So, that... Uh, but you know what? This video is predictions. So uh, <laughs> let's let's make let's go back to the list and let me say um, I'm going to predict that they will tell us um, they'll tell us some more information on Bayonetta three. I'm going to say Bayonetta three is because like literally we've heard nothing and I feel like this would be a perfect time to announce Bayonetta three. Bayonetta three could be the holiday title. Title it could be. Um, I say that in quotes. But usually holiday titles are like system sellers, so I don't see Bayonetta 3 is doing that. I see Breath of the Wild 2 could be doing that, but if, you know, Breath of the Wild 1 didn't already do that for the people that are buying Breath of the Wild 2, I, I, I don't know. Um, also, another thing that I actually want to add to this list that I hope that could happen and should happen, um, you know, I want it to happen. Uh, Super Mario Odyssey 2, anybody? Yeah, that'd be cool. Um, getting same engine, just another story, more worlds, you know, more enemies to capture. Seems like a cool thing, and I really wish they would just reuse the assets, because honestly, that game was awesome. S-tier game, we already discussed this in my S-tier games video. Uh, so yeah, just reuse the assets and do it again, man. Like, that, that's awesome. So anyways, I've rambled on for a ton of time already. It's over 10 minutes for sure. Um, and you know what? In this direct, or it's gonna be an Animal Crossing direct, and then they're gonna sprinkle in some like third party games, second party games. They're gonna just gonna sprinkle some stuff in there. They're gonna sprinkle some indie games in there. Might get like another bombshell announcement in the mix there. Could be Breath of the Wild 2, could be Bayonetta 3, could be Metroid P Prime Remake, could be Re Metroid Trilogy Remake, it could be Paper Mario, some sort of Paper Mario something, it could be a Super Mario Odyssey Remake, not Remake, <laughs> all these remakes, no, Super Mario Odyssey 2, uh, we got the Breath of the Wild 2, Super Mario, Super Mario Odyssey, I'm, sp I'm mumbling over my own tongue, man. I'm mumbling and fumbling over my own tongue. Super Mario 
Odyssey 2. There's a lot of supers going on here. Um, there's really only one super going on here. Without me going on and wasting any more of your time, I'd like you to please um, give me a comment. Tell me, know, let me know uh, what you want to see in this direct, what you, you are really excited for. Are you going to get that new Animal Crossing limited edition Switch? Um, because I really want to. And that would be awesome if you could send it to my house. I'm just kidding. I, I don't expect you to uh, give me anything except for a like on this video. That'd be awesome. Please uh, like this video and share it and uh, tell your friends, tell your family, tell your grandma. Doesn't matter. Uh, just share it around. We'll see you in the next one. Um, once we get an announcement on when that thing, that direct is coming, I will put up a video for a live reaction. I'm 99% sure I'll be able to do that live reaction unless it's like literally right at like 10 or something because that's like right in the middle of my work schedule and that might not happen so <laughs> anyways i need i need to go get a drink of something i don't know lipton iced tea maybe my throat's getting a little hoarse coarse ah it's coarse is the word yeah man. okay we'll see you guys next time sorry for rambling but uh it's one of those videos we'll see you next time see ya